Okay, I've added some more salt in there and stirred it up. You can kind of see it floating around there. It's uh, sea salt. It's uh, probably a half stuff that's more fine. Now you could use baking soda too. Um, at any rate, I think it's producing more hydrogen. And if we go over here to the left, to the right a little bit, we'll see that that's producing supposedly the chlorine gas. So don't breathe this stuff. Whatever you do, don't breathe it. Just, in fact, you probably ought not even light it. And if you do, make sure you take it outside and uh, just be safe. Maybe even put some earmuffs on because it could cause a uh, loud explosion. So, anyway, there you go. There's your uh, basic hydrogen electrolyzer uh, that's producing hydrogen in a very small amount. And uh, later on in my website, which is uh, www.making-hydrogen.com, uh, I'll have other videos on there I'm making with a 555 uh, timer circuit and uh, a MOSFET and uh, to produce hydrogen it's a, what's called a pulse width modulator it's just a simple oscillator circuit um, and uh, we'll see what that does for us